guys, welcome back to another very annoying section in the deep playthrough. We need a disc. Oh, 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 oh. oh shit! Go, 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 go! Very nice that there's a checkpoint. Here we go. Was not expecting that at all. Immediately screwing it up. Shouldn't have dropped that grenade that early. Should have placed it better. Like I will be doing now. Oh shit! Take them down! Was not expecting that. 
Probably that worked because I removed his helmet, then they're vulnerable. Pretty good. God damn it, I was really expecting to be here for another half an hour retrying. Because up front you're not sure how mad you will be swarmed. And holy shit, what the hell was that? Oh, we're not in the clear yet. Holy shit. No, no, no. Okay. So, there are still dudes coming out of there. And here we go. Watch out for that new dude. Alright. That was part of the game. At least we got through that annoying section. Already pretty glad with that. And that probably is a shove. Well, now that was quite the fall. You had me worried. Come, it's time for a reunion. He wouldn't give you up, despite my efforts to persuade him. Sam! Jesus. Hey, you made it. Dude. It's all right. He is like a girl. Is that right? How about we get these cuffs off and I'll show you how girls hit. Why is Nadine so hostile towards him, I must admit, Sam. you are quite the schemer. First you steal my disc, then you have your expert run me around in circles, huh? <laughs> That's clever. Perhaps there's a little Indian blood in you after all. Finish what we started. All right, all right. <laughs> all right, any treasures here? Why not oh, just take out that dude? Us. Don't talk to me. <laughs> I was gonna say, you look good. Was I not clear? Why not just take him out, goddammit? I'm sorry, I haven't exactly had access to running water and soap recently. All the people you could have brought with you. She saved my ass more than once, you know. You do remember that uh, she also tried to kill Nathan and I many, many times. And to be fair, you two tried to do the same to her. Uh, yeah, but that, that's not the point. The point is that the second we turn our backs, there will be a knife in there. I can hear every word you're saying. I know! I trust her. <laughs> you know what? Fine. I guess I'm just a little bit hurt that we are walking away with nothing. But I guess you know what that's like, right? <laughs> <coughs> 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 
Oh, my... Real classy, thank you. Time and place, children. More that came from. Bike racks after school. Ugh. Just hurry up. Hopefully there will be a checkpoint. We don't have to do this stroll all over again. After failing somewhere here. Looks pretty cool again, the graphics. Graf Picios. Looks pretty like reflective, real like gold. Can really appreciate good materials, material graphics, textures. The kings have one final test. Looks like you won't be needing us, though, so we'll just be on. Oh, our on day. the contrary. Surely you know the story. <laughs> you see, Shiva gave Parashuram the mighty axe that struck Ganesh in the face, bringing Shiva's son, one of the greatest of the gods, to his knees. Another casualty of war. Don't. Yeah, seriously, Chloe, he's just gonna kill him. He's right. But if you refuse, you will watch them die, inch by inch. All right! <laughs> Chloe, don't! Ashaf, the dude. Is that him over there? Yes. Right, now what? Any treasure here? It's a pretty high room. Let's not deny that. And let's check it all out a bit. We have something over here. Wait. Let's see if there's some dialogue. Oh. Don't try anything stupid. So we have a dude over there. With Enough. Coward. A really small trident. And missing something into his right arms. Or actually three of his hands are like empty. And here we have a dude with a big axe. That probably can swing down quite violently. We have multiple moving thingies <coughs> or levers. Parashurama and Ganesh. And here is Parashurama hitting, uh, uh, yeah, axing of the tusk of Ganesh. Let's see what this one does. <coughs> Shiva and Parashurama. Shiva what now? giving the axe to Parashurama. Any more? Need some encouragement? <coughs> oh God! What the hell? So that was a timed section. Okay, let's see what we got. Why would he kill them while I was solving his puzzle? <laughs> Probably Shiva it's in Parashurama. It's in an order. Shiva and Parashurama. Over there, it's like a really weird. Ah, I have to fix that picture over there. But how can I fix it? Do I fix it by turning this thingy? No. But it's like this the circular rose or 
bands lanes are like messed up they have to be set into order <coughs> What now? Ah, did this one activate? Yes. Chloe, don't you give this schmuck what he wants. Quiet. Press X to change which dial you are rotating. Alright, let's start with the outer one, like so. And we will do. Dial fitting. You're testing my patience. Here, this one. Oh. Now we will be turning this whole way like so. And we will be getting that one. That one. No. All right. So we will do this one. And we will be doing this one. He's yielding. It's going to fall. Quiet! Ganesh, quite an obstacle you've placed in my path. Right. Change active arm or finish. He is yielding, so all the arms shoot go down I guess um. like so what are you doing shut up and watch he yielded who are you huh you're all right yeah, that was unexpected. Holy shit, she's got balls, huh? I, I don't understand. It's an idiot. That's because you've got it all twisted, my friend. Ganesh allowed himself to be struck by the axe. That makes no sense. Not to a selfish prick, no. You see, Ganesh could have defeated Parashurama easily, but if he had, that would have made Shiva's axe look weak, powerless. Gonna sacrifice himself to preserve his father's honor. See, even she gets it, not a drop of Indian blood in her. <laughs> the tusk. Beautiful. Pretty small. Magnificent, isn't it? For a godlike elephant. Oh, what? Nothing to say now? Oh, if you like, I can tell you where to stick it. <laughs> <laughs> well, my friends, I would love to kill you myself, but we must not anger the gods, for you have brought me a great fortune. Okay, then, what are you doing? You're going to flood the chamber. I will miss you. Come on, is this really necessary? You know, nothing is ever truly destroyed. Only purified and reborn. Just shoot us and get it over with. Right? As the water fills your lungs, you will have time to reflect on the choices that brought you here. 
Perhaps in your next lives, you will fare better. Frick. What an asshole. I don't know about you guys, but I got a lot of regrets swimming around in my head right now. Well, tell me about it. I was really looking forward to kicking your ass again. Hey, you know, I'm not exactly thrilled about drowning next to you, either. Could you give it a rest, guys? I'm trying to concentrate. What are you doing? A little preparation goes a long way. Ha-ha! <laughs> yes! Shit! Look, look! I've got it! Hold on! Ah. Okay, don't do me! Coming! Oh, okay, all right. Damn it! Ah! Uh, Ladies first! Chloe, dear, not to rush you, but... Could you please hurry the hell up? Take a deep breath! <laughs> about a really it's annoying awesome. helicopter sequence. How the hell did Asaf get that helicopter? That's with that helicopter. What do you Probably. Mean? Still heard Asaf talking about <clears throat> heading to the old rail yard, something about an arms deal. He's selling the tusk. So much for preserving his culture. Hey, just a second. Listen, uh, <clears throat> back there. Thanks for Professional courtesy. <laughs> of course. So, are we good? No. I figured. If we hurry, we can intercept them before they make the sale. Huh. And there's our ride. These are nice. There. Railroad tracks. Stop here. Uh, and chapter uh, eight. The server have lookouts throughout the area. Best door on the side of caution. Right, right, right. And then we lose the tusk. You're welcome to stay behind. I'm just you saying. Right, 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 right. Less talking, more walking. So all that time in Asov's care, and you couldn't get any intel on the bias. <clears throat> Uh, well, I tried. They saw the cagey one. Almost never talked shop in front of me. Yeah, can't imagine why. Hey, he trusted me enough to believe I was an expert in all this hoist law. Hoist the law. Yeah, the two. <sighs> right. By the way, thanks for keeping him busy for us. Check in yeah. for well, a treasure. Buy some time in case <laughs> you were coming to get me. Of it's course probably we were. the way we need to go. Let's so over there. I thought I was a goner. So I let's let that happen. Check the other side. Your brother would never let me hear the end of it. Here it is. Nope. And let's check the view. Is there any photo opportunity over here? Nope. All right, so we have a railway. I think there's also a train section and a helicopter section. A kind of boss battle, boss fight. But first we have to get to there. And that is, I guess, by following those train tracks, more or less, getting up there and getting over there. Uh, there's a slide down there, like straight ahead, 
like it's, it's diagonal uh, with a jump in the middle then you get over there towards those yellow flowers just above Chloe's head and then we are already pretty close to uh, closer by the railway tracks so that's all good and there's a city in the far distance so I guess we have our work cut out for us ah no we actually probably have to get inside that waterfall over there it seems it looks hollow um, so get to the yellow flowers above Chloe's head and then probably climb up and get into that waterfall cave thingy over there uh, we have our work cut out for us in the next for the next episodes uh, this is like a very opportune moment in between the action to end this episode and continue in the next one guys hope you enjoyed and hope to see you in the next one for the meantime do not forget as always keep on gaming see you later